What started as her disappearance became a murder inquiry and has now turned into something even more grotesque. A week and a half since Becky Watts went missing, the discovery of body parts has brought a cruel end to the optimism she may still be alive. In Bristol, this is now a very different type of investigation altogether. Becky's family had already said they were preparing for the worst. The distressing details released by police earlier were truly that. The information suggested that Becky's body had been cut up and a search at the new location resulted in the discovery of body parts. Although formal identification procedures have not yet been completed, we have made Becky's family aware of this discovery. Becky's mum, gran and brother issued these words. We are devastated to be told of this latest development, they said. We are at an utter loss to understand why anyone would want to hurt our beautiful Becky in such a brutal way. Whilst there are people in custody, none of whom are connected to the Watts family, we will not be making any further comment. Police are speaking to new suspects and examining new locations. While a man and woman are still being questioned about Becky's murder, a further four men and a woman were today arrested on suspicion of assisting an offender. After receiving new information overnight, police started searching the house here earlier today. It's around 100 metres or so from a property they were already investigating. And it's here where that shocking discovery was made. Residents in the neighbouring homes had their wheelie bins taken by police for examination. The last rubbish collection in this area took place before Becky went missing. Detectives are now trying to work out why Becky was here and what led to her death, a mile and a half away from where she lived. And tonight, the father and stepmother of the 16-year-old say the details which had now emerged about her death are simply too much to bear.